Hello, today's video we have the following content. It is also a torture scene. How many Jin Dongs did Wang Yibo in the Storm Chaser slap in the face? Storm Chaser is like a hurricane sweeping across the country's screens, reaching peak ratings in a row, and its popularity is strong, surpassing the hit dramas Little Days and Walking with the Phoenix at the same time. Wang Yibo is like a phoenix rising from the ashes in this drama, achieving a stunning counterattack. At the beginning of the series, people expected that the on-screen couple Wang Yibo and Lee Kin would capture many viewers with their charm, especially under the shining halo of CCTV. Unexpectedly, the collision of characters between Wang Yibo and Wang Yang was like a thunderstorm. The ground fire was stirred, and an unexpected bright light burst out. The character played by Wang Yibo is like a new bud in early spring, clear and straightforward, which is in sharp contrast to the sophisticated and sophisticated character interpreted by Wang Yang. Between the character construction and acting duel, the two are like meeting a close friend in a mountain and flowing water. Every interaction is like a harmonious resonance. There is a subtle electric spark between their eyes, weaving the story of the relationship between the seasoned hero and a budding talent in a troubled world. Jun's admiration and appreciation, and talent saw and following of his mentor. Wang Yibo's performance in The Storm Chaser was astonishing, especially his performance opposite veteran actor Wang Yang. His leap in acting skills was eye-catching. Nowadays, the label traffic has often become a stereotype, and many viewers will frown slightly when they see the names of traffic actors. However, Wang Yibo challenged the stereotype this time and broke the prejudice with his solid and excellent acting skills, which effectively proved that as long as he has a solid foundation and outstanding acting skills, the word traffic will eventually become a floating cloud in the audience's mind and be easily brushed away. At this moment, let us put aside our established ideas and walk into Wang Yibo's exciting and wonderful performances in the Wind Chaser 3 pictures, texts and in-depth details. Especially in several shocking masochistic scenes, Wang Yibo's performance can be regarded as a model for young actors. In the first life and death battle, in order to protect a precious gold bar, a bookish young man played by Wang Yibo, despite being single and weak, resolutely stood up to fight against the brutal gangsters. In the end, he was embarrassed and his shirt was stained with blood. Although the makeup technique lacks a little in terms of realism, Wang Yibo makes up for it with his soulful and devoted performance. His face was like broken porcelain, covered in devastation, but he still relied on his indomitable and unyielding spiritual power to tightly hug the enemy's thigh. The whole character seemed to be transformed into a stubborn and fearless warrior, selfless and decisive. At that moment, Wang Yibo seemed to have his soul and character merged into one, showing extreme fatigue and pain. He pressed his lips tightly together and his face was twisted, as if every nerve was twitching in pain. When the enemy draws out his deadly weapon, Wang Yibo's emotions change like a sudden storm, from heartbreaking wails bursting out in fierce physical conflicts to desperate screams when facing a life and death crisis. Every emotional outburst is like a sharp ice pick, it penetrates deeply into the hearts of the audience. At the critical moment of life and death, Wei Rulei's character appeared at the right time and rescued the exhausted Wang Yibo. At this time, he exhausted his last bit of strength and fell to the ground feebly. At this moment, he had fallen deeply into the character's soul world. Comma so that every viewer can deeply understand the various hardships the characters have experienced. The subsequent dungeon torture sequence once again demonstrated the highlight of Wang Yibo's acting skills. He delicately grasped the character's real physiological reaction when suffering the pain of whipping, without deliberately exaggerating or mechanically expressing fear. He was suspended in the air, his body and spirit crumbling under the double pressure of fatigue and pain. The whip fell on his body like a snake's letter, and the pain quickly spread to all parts of his body like ripples, making him tremble again and again. The performance is like penetrating the flesh to the bone marrow, and is deeply rooted in the hearts of the people. Wang Yibo carefully crafted the character's depressed state under extreme difficulties, which sublimated the authenticity of the performance. Under the endless torture, the character's body and soul were tortured, and the pain gradually became numb but was everywhere. Wang Yibo did not choose to over-exaggerate or show off his acting skills, but accurately portrayed the subtlety of the character hovering on the edge of physical and mental collapse. The state, the proportion is just right. In the climax of cigarette butt burning, the camera captured the subtle changes in Wang Yibo's facial expression at close range, and every subtle change was full of layers. The moment the cigarette butt touched his chest, he trembled instantly as if he was stimulated by ice, and the pain was like a rolling wave, rushing in violently. As the torturer's intensity intensified, 
Wang Yibo's facial muscles tightened like a bowstring, and the inexpressible pain carved a deep mark on his face, deeply touching the heartstrings of every audience member. The pain in the play is like the fangs of a ferocious beast tearing apart flesh and blood. Wang Yibo's face seems to be a resonant stone. Every muscle fiber silently sings an aria of pain. Along with the broken wail that penetrates the screen, his trembling body is like the strings were plucked ruthlessly, striking the depths of every audience member's soul, making people clench their hands in cold sweat. It was a sign of deep empathy for the character's pain and uncontrollable waves of tension in their hearts. The moment the cigarette butt was extinguished, Wang Yibo was like an uncooled spark. Although the pain was still burning, he persisted in the role tenaciously and endured with the remaining pain. Facing the secret agents pressing step by step, he was like a dying phoenix, with only a trace of breath left, but he tried his best to flap his wings. He delivered the decisive lines with hoarse but sonorous and powerful words, cutting through the darkness like a meteor, leaving a profound trajectory. Full stop. Wang Yibo showed outstanding acting potential in the vortex of emotional torrent, like a beacon in the storm, bright and firm. Although the more subtle and complex static scenes need to be polished, the director of Storm Chaser relies on his superb lens language art, like a skilled painter, using multiple interwovings of light, shadow and perspective to delicately depict Wei Rulei played by Wang Yibo the tragic scene after being tortured further highlighted Wang Yibo's performance power. The storm of electrocution ensued, reminiscent of Zhang Yi's classic scene in Above the Cliff, whose thunderous acting skills are still shining in the entertainment industry. This time, Wang Yibo was like a warrior standing in the center of a thunderstorm. The moment the conductive iron rod touched his ribs, his body felt like it was struck by lightning. He couldn't stop convulsing. Every hair on his body stood upright in fear. He was so helpless. The action of raising his head and rolling his eyes accurately captured the critical point of extreme pain, which made people marvel at his meticulous acting skills. The aftermath of the electric shock passed by, and Wang Yibo's facial expression was like a dynamic picture, gradually transitioning from violent convulsions to subtle emotional ripples. His mouth opened naturally, swallowing the pain like an abyss, and his eyeballs almost broke through the shackles of the eye sockets. Every muscle on the face is trembling, telling the horror of the raging electric current. This performance makes people's blood rush and their hearts are filled with admiration. In the climax of the finale, when drug injection became the ultimate means of destroying Wei Rulei, the cold long needle in the hand of the spy leader was like a devil's tentacles, piercing deeply into the flesh. The highly toxic liquid spread rapidly, like a flood covering the riverbed. Penetrates throughout the body. The camera was close again. At this time, Wang Yibo was no longer able to express any deliberate expression. Only his eyes rolled toward the sky empty and weak as if every trembling of the pupils and every trace of time in the corners of the eyes were whispering, I we have reached our limit. This profound portrayal of despair and tenacity is unforgettable. Wang Yibo's series of profound and touching performances in this work successfully subverted the audience's previous cognitive framework. The director's discerning eye gave him a broad stage to display his talents, and he himself also relied on his tenacious perseverance, successfully created a vivid and three-dimensional character. There is no doubt that Wang Yibo's performance this time is amazing, refreshing people's new definition of handsome acting. In today's entertainment industry, some young popular actors are actively seeking breakthroughs and sublimations in their acting skills like butterflies emerging from their cocoons. In stark contrast, there are some middle-aged actors who stick to their comfort zone. They squander the audience's trust like a waste. The treasure gradually fell into dust. Take Jin Dong as an example. Even though he was also in an electrocution scene, his performance lost its sense of reality to overly stylized binding and superficial performance. Under the gorgeous clothes, his face was full of flesh and blood swaying with the movements, making him appear to be out of context. Full stop. Let's look at Wang Lei again. No matter when and where, his role always seems to be closely bound to the world of fireworks. He is like a fish in water in variety shows, but once he steps into the crew, he neglects to shape his body. For example, when he plays a terminal cancer patient in Xiao Min's family, his image is still plump and bloated lying on the hospital bed, which is very different from the character's sad temperament. His appearance in County Party Committee Courtyard aroused a lot of ridicule from the audience. In addition to the comic effect, it can't help but feel regretful. Many middle-aged actors who are well known in the country have rich film and television resources, are good at showing their charisma on the variety show stage, and are eloquent in interviews. However, when the real acting test comes, 
they often fail to reach the expected height. This this reality gap makes people full of emotions. Fortunately, in the current Chinese film and television industry, there are still a group of young actors who are striving to move forward. They cherish every opportunity, move forward, and are committed to improving their professional qualities. Returning to the world of Wind Chaser, Wang Yibo's unique charm and superb acting skills are certainly eye-catching, but the success of this feast is also inseparable from the tacit cooperation of the other actors opposite him. The reason why those extremely cruel interrogation scenes can make the audience feel the strong reality and shock is not only the power of Wang Yibo alone, but also powerful actors such as Zhang Xiaoyan Yang who devote themselves to it with full emotion and professional attitude. The burning eyes and fully devoted performance jointly create an audiovisual feast, pushing the plot to a climax and deeply engraved in the hearts of every audience. Did Wang Yibo's outstanding performance in The Storm Chaser also move you and sincerely admire him? Thank you.